We begin our show tonight with a follow up. An emergency order aimed at limiting tourism in San Luis Obispo County goes into effect today. It applies to hotels, motels, campgrounds, RV parks, vacation rentals and other lodging. KSBY News reporter Alice Becerra shows us how tourists visiting the Central Coast could be impacted. Alice. Megan, limiting tourism will mean that hotels and campgrounds will have to cut their occupancy rate by 50 percent. There are people that might remember that and drive right by your county. An emergency order began Sunday limiting hotel and short term lodging occupancy rates to no more than 50 percent only for essential travel. One couple from San Diego visiting Ragged Point Inn say they disagree with the need for the order. Numbers are coming down and they're getting more restrictive. That doesn't seem right. People are wearing masks, they're staying, you know, they're physical distancing. Why are we going backwards? Another guest visiting from Texas says he hasn't run into any sanitation issues while paying the Central Coast a visit. I think they're doing an exceptional job here, better than I saw in Northern Cal, better than I saw in Dallas, better than I saw in Colorado of keeping these rooms. Probably as clean, if not better than most of our houses. According to the Public Health Department, the order is being put in place as an effort to prevent people in other communities from spreading the virus in San Luis Obispo County. Included in the order, campgrounds such as Lopez Lake, Oceano Memorial Park, and Santa Margarita Lake will be limited to only San Luis Obispo County residents starting Monday. The Public Health Department for San Luis Obispo County says that allowing that 50% occupancy rate was meant to be an accommodation for the lodging of essential workers while also discouraging visitors from coming to the area. I'm Alice Becerra, KSBY News. And that emergency order will be reviewed every 14 days.